Sacaboni and Nigel McGinnis. Oh boy. by Buddy Matthews, weighing 219 pounds. He is honoring the House of Black, Malachi Black. Ian Riccoboni, I'm telling you, this is a intimidating sight for Malachi Black. Any member of the House of Black makes their way to the ring. It certainly is, and last Saturday on Collision, Tony, it was the House of Black that decided that Adam Copeland was the next target on the House of Black, of the House of Black. And Nigel, we've seen Malachi Black in single competition. Now, of course, that big six man coming up at Dynasty. And Malachi Black now with a target on the back of one of the great competitors in Ring of Honor and AEW history, the Fallen Angel. Well, that's right, it was the veteran Christopher Daniels, who took umbrage to the fact that Malachi Black, the dark and foreboding leader of the House of Black, attacked angry Adam. Buddy Matthews left him laying in the center of the ring, were it not for Mark Briscoe, who again stuck his nose in the House of Black's business, and Eddie Kingston, who got involved as well. Saturday night would have been a very bad night for the TNT champion. Let's go to Bobby Cruz once again. Bobby. His opponent, the Fallen Angel, Christopher Daniels. Tell you what, Christopher Daniels looks in fantastic shape. Yes, he does. One of the, as you 